It's a question we've been asking ourselves since the shooting rampage at Sandy Hook Elementary School. Should school employees be allowed to have guns? Tonight, 23 ABC's Kelly Johnson was there at the meeting as the Kern High School District answered yes to that question. Jean Tomei is the owner at Bear Mountain Sports. When it comes to allowing guns at Kern High School District campuses, he's all for it, saying it will make schools safer. But the way it is right now, it just leaves them wide open. They're vulnerable. Over the summer, the board voted unanimously to allow non staff members with concealed carry permits on campus with the superintendent's permission. This is a Colt 1911 style. Today, the district board took a vote for CCW permit holding teachers and staff members to do the same. Check out the size of these guns. Some of them are even smaller than the palm of my hand, which would make it easy to conceal and carry. The Dolores Huerta Foundation led the protest outside the district boardroom just minutes before the school board meeting. This Multiple board members of the community schools, were furious the issue would even issue be considered. Today. One said he's concerned that even those with the best training would act differently in certain circumstances. When crisis set in, people act differently. Opponents were also angry that such an important issue would be voted on during school and work hours when most principals, teachers, and others impacted would be unable to express their concerns to the board. People can't get off work. They can't get here. This is a time of day that students are getting out of school. Tomei says he understands those who oppose. There's some teachers that just absolutely are afraid of guns. They don't want to carry. I understand that. But believes those with bad intentions would think twice before committing a mass school shooting. Shooting. Please let the teacher next door have his option whether to protect him and his neighbors.